Hello and welcome back to Fallout 4 with History Loves Hinder the Mad. Now, last time we discovered that there's a fair few, few people here. Oh, so we can have a nap. That's my legs back to full health. Excellent. Uh, actually, we visited Hubris Comics, got ourselves an axe, and did other things. Such as not actually activate. No, no, that that I could have this time. We did activate the uh, trap in the previous bit. I was not happy with the results. Not happy at all. I wish I had a silenced weapon. What the hell? But it appears I do not. Where'd that come from? Stay still, jump. Anyone else want to lose their heads? <laughs> Keep it there. Thank you. Did you just push the corpse out of the way? Does that make sense? To some extent. But you know, you just went up to someone who was your friend and you just pushed him out of the way. Like it was nothing. Like, I thought minus 50 rats would be more than this. Yeah, okay. Let's continue our head hunting. There's got to be more head somewhere. Because I'm not going to be hunting for tail. It's all about heads. There is one more survivor. Oh, he hit it off way back. Anyway, he is hoping the scrounger perk comes true and gives you more 308 ammo. Yep. Though it's more likely that I will get a huge load of 405. At which point I might as well grab one of their submachine guns and use it against them. Yes. For it is the nice thing to do, you know, it's a gift that keeps on giving. They try to give me bullets, I give them back. Sweet. Re gifting is it cool man. You know, sometimes sometimes you just you just gotta do what you gotta do. To survive, you know? It's a short hunting rifle. I've got a better one than a short hunting rifle. I've got a tactical thingy. That's like tactics included. Because it's tactical. It's probably the other side. But tactical. Got it. You know, I should actually start working on getting myself a nice little uh, weapon workshop going with nice little materials, springs, the like. Yeah, and then I could rename this gun Bob. Tactical Bob. That's the plan. I will for obviously forget about it, but you know, that is the plan. Alright, keep the rifle out just in case. Get in stealth, just in case. And like look around for each every single container in case there's 308 ammo anywhere. I'm not sure why I'm grabbing razor green. That's gonna be a, like a nightmare to plant. Did I kill anyone over here? Like I remember I shot s someone's brains out in this relative direction. Was it you? Did they shoot your brains out? Was it you that shoot your brains out? Well, they don't seem to have any, so... Hmm... Might have been him? I don't know... Uh, this is the guy just... That simply got, like, dragged around. Tactical hair trigger 10mm pistol. Well, it's probably an upgrade over... The usual 10mm pistol, so um, 
10 mm pistol tactical 10 mm pistol yeah there we go um you there are no longer a favorite stop trying to be a favorite okay i'm gonna Right, so that's what happened with the shotguns as well, I would assume. What the fuck, game? What the fuck? Probably need to reinstall it at some point. Like, it's just acting up like weird, man. Really weird. Because... If I want to launch the game, I have to dive out of it as soon as it opens up, otherwise it's just CTDs. And like, that's no fun. So that's not how you get to enjoy a game. If it complete, like, if it takes a workaround to actually launch the fucking thing. Yeah. Oh well. <sighs> that also put me in the right mood at every beginning session of the game though because every time I launch the game I have to go through the whole mess again and sometimes it doesn't work so for this uh, recording session I had to launch it like 10 times and then I finally got it working joy yeah I'll take your nuke cola bitch ah yes about that I think we may be coming in contact again soon. Yes, like that's a trigger man. Oh, he survived. What a surprise. Looks like we need different tactic. One that includes eating some red roaches, because that's what we always do. Ah, they've hurt me again. It feels so hurt. Where are you? Oh, here. Oh, right over here. Hello. Well, I'm gonna need a bed again. So, show me where your beds are, gentlemen. Or I will take them over. You don't need them anymore. You're dead. Dead, I say. Dead. And that's the exit that uh, Nick will want to use. We will not want to use that exit because... Well, maybe with you. Like, we can continue following the Freedom Trail from the surface, if need be. Do you have anything nice? No. Where's the other guy I killed? Here? Did he have anything nice? Yeah, Gold Watch, that's pretty nice. Especially in, in this day and age. You still don't get like any extra money for it. Hey, that's my bus line. The one that takes me from from the city. It's city. I get enough like it for no hour. There's no one here. It's just your imagination, buddy. Just your imagination. Where'd he go? Which one of you lost? 
Ah. The boss says hello. And I say bye. There's another one. It's not showing up there. Right, that requires a key that opens up easily enough. I don't know if there's... Well, there's a matter of ways. And the Vortex Terminal. The Vort 111 jumps it. Like, I think the new ones I have are supposed to have the script as well to just add you like an open suit. Come out! I'll do you quick. Sir? I have no interest in. Try to give me the slip! Ah, oh, are we going melee? <laughs> I can go melee. <laughs> oh, I think you're melee. The melons are like a nightmare to plant as well. Do they need like a large variety of food to keep stay happy? Or are they just happy with having uh, enough food? Because mud fruits and carrots and those are like the easiest to plant. So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of con all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. All right. What? Oh, you'll pay time to put you on ice. Oh, we're low on health. Dog meat, dog meat. I'm gonna require you to stick a steam back in my pack. Steam back in my pack. Oh, squirrel bits actually do radiation, so I'm gonna drop that. Let's have a couple of your friend species. Man's best friend. Or a wastelander's best snack. No one knows. It's the same, really, isn't it? Very similar. Very similar indeed. Hello. Oh god, fuck. This is this place. I, I don't like this place. For obvious reasons, there's gonna be a lot of contact here. There's your hat, boy. There's my health, boy. Could have gone better. How would this work against him? Oh, I'll fight you. What the? Very poorly. Like the pistol did far more damage. What the fuck is up with this laser rifle? Okay, well, if that's the case... <coughs> I guess I'm gonna go head hunting again. That guy has a sturdy head there. That's one down. Hand the steam back to me. Okay, that's a melee fighter. Can you bring it? Oh, you're a more competent melee fighter than the other one was. Except you still can't hit me. Okay, that's my last magazine of 308. <sighs> Less. I still need to heal. Mm. Do we have more red roach? Yeah, we do. Great. Maybe a little bit of. Mm, not gonna eat that. Not gonna eat that. Oh, an iguana on a stick. Yeah, I'm gonna have that. <laughs> I 
there we go. Once again, this could have gone better, but yeah, yeah shit happens. You know how it is. Don't you dog meat? Yeah. But this dog meat knows. Maybe you need to because you have also probably played video games. Video games can kind of bite you in the ass sometimes. Just a little bit. Just a nipple. Alright, what do we have here? A mining helmet. Just hidden off on a platform somewhere. All alone. With no one to witness it being a thing. Was there. But there's a bag of cement which would allow us to build more concrete structures back at home. Do we want it? The answer is yes. Because. Well, actually, we're gonna build ourselves a nice little residence, but still, the concrete will help out. Like, I'm not gonna just build up random concrete walls. The, uh, the real estate back is something that's in Snap and Build, so I'm gonna use that. So, I'll have a beautiful house in the middle of ruined buildings. Like, literally in the middle of them. It's gonna be absolutely dumb. You know what, uh, because I don't have a lot of grenades, do I? I've got two. In that case, we're just gonna throw down a fire. <coughs> Which apparently took out my legs. Whoops. But there's a bed right next to here, right? Yeah. Just... Guys, you're a over. I can't even crouch like this. Both my legs were out. Did I actually get anyone with that? No, because there was no one here. I was expecting there to be someone here. Because this is usually where someone is. Bastards. Alright, well, that's out of ammo. That's... that's good ammo. But uh, I think 10mm pistol will have to do. Like, I think that's offering us the highest odds of survival. But survival yeah, is pretty nice to have around, you know? Yeah. Uh okay, okay then. So How you doing in there, Valentine? Feeling hungry? Want a snack? Keep talking, meathead. It'll give Skinny Malone more time to think about how he's gonna bump you off. Don't give me that crap, Valentine. You know nothing, you got nothing. Really? I saw him writing your name down in that black book of his. Lousy cheating card huh? shark, I think were his exact words. <coughs> and he struck the name across three times. Sorry about disrupting your conversation here. But I was hoping to get a sneak attack off, which you did not. Instead, I'm gonna die. You? I don't know who you are, but we got three minutes before they realize. Okay, I do need some aid though. Like, first aid. A couple of chumps and maybe a little bit of chops. No? I got bored. Muscles for brains ain't coming back. Get this door open. Sure, sure. Hold your horses. Take number. 998. Okay. Hmm. You gotta hack that terminal to open up this door. Yeah, yeah, I'm just waiting for my turn, you know. But where's the number even? I can't see it, so let's skip the whole wait. I guess it's fine. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, very nice. Got it. So, how are you doing? Oh, that's a bubble head. Bingo. Haha, <laughs> my knight in shining armor. Question is, why does he come all this way and risk life and limb for an old private eye? I need you to find someone, but it's 
complicated. I don't exactly know where they could be or how long they've been gone. Well, I've done jobs with less. Somehow nice and simple never makes it onto the menu in my world. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Okie dokie. But first things first. Malone's crew here used to be small time. Muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger players. Until they found this place. Don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. Empty vault. Perfect hideout. Like, those are actually really amusing to listen to, but we'll do so at some other point because we're currently on a mission. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck is that shit? Why is he there? What is he? What is going on even? Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.